The name John Buchan today gets almost no recognition, though in 1915 this minor British career diplomat made big waves with a spy novel titled The 39 Steps. That novel itself would have also been forgotten if not for a talented young British director named Alfred Hitchcock, who, along with a couple of collaborators, created a not very faithful adaptation for a film in 1935. This was the film that turned the director into an icon and is now considered a classic of the cinema, though it's pretty creaky. And that creakiness came into play when two playwrights, Simon Corbell and Nobby Diamond, wrote a four-actor comic version in the 1990s, which was later updated in 2005 by Patrick Barlow. His version hit Broadway with a bang in 2008, lasting two years and over 700 performances, followed by a highly successful national tour. And it's that version which is currently running at San Francisco Playhouse, directed by Susie DeMilano, through April 20th. A very good Phil Wong plays Richard Hannay, a middle-aged slacker who goes to a magic show where shots are fired. He's then intercepted by a young woman who is apparently in danger. Within a short time, Hannay is on the run, pursued by both police and spies. The various women he's involved with are all played by Maggie Mason with suitable airs of mystery, and the rest are portrayed by Greg Ayers and Renee Rogoff, trading off roles and genders with the flick of a dress, a jacket, or a hat. With the action moving at breakneck speed, using whatever props are at hand, chairs, tables, ropes, hat stands, and characters disappearing, reappearing, pretending, lying, dying, it's easy to lose track of the plot, which is kind of the idea. Nothing really makes sense, but that's okay. The show was spent over a decade as a crowd pleaser and laugh generator, and the San Francisco Playhouse production shows why. If there's any caveat to this production, it's more the fault of a certain San Francisco tradition of comedy, which allows for a loose overplaying that sometimes gets out of hand. Accents too thick to understand, double and triple and even quadruple takes, all too knowing nods to the audience. If you like your comedy subtle, this may be a little too slapstick for your taste. But for most everyone else, it's a great way to get out from under today's political horrors and spending an hour and a half laughing with your peers. The 39 Steps, directed by Susie Damilano, plays at San Francisco Playhouse through April 20th. For more information, you can go to sfplayhouse.org. I'm Richard Walensky on Bay Area Theater for KPFA.